Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Lord, we thank you for another blessing of this day you've given us, Lord. We thank you for your leadership, your guidance in life each and every day. Lord, we thank you for your grace and your mercy. Lord, we ask you for thy presence to be here tonight. Be with each person here, Lord. I pray that thy hand be upon the Lord. Father, I pray that you be with this couple. It's to come together in marriage. That the anointing of God be upon them. Lord, be with us tonight. Lead us in the way you have us to go. Father, let all things be for thy glory and thy honor. In Christ's name we do ask that God's keep us safe. Amen. dreamed and prayed for this day all my life. I never thought at 11 years old you would be the one. I can't wait to be your wife. I love you so much. Love you more than anything else in this world. I hope I measure up to all you need in my wife. I want to try my best to be the wife that God would have me to be. Now let's get married. Love you, babe. Love of my life, as I sit here writing this letter at 3.30 a.m., I can still see you now sitting on your mama's lap as we were fixing to pray in the new year. That's the first time I laid eyes on you. Ever since that day, I knew God had big plans for us some way, somehow. Then as time went on, I asked you to be my girlfriend. We enjoyed that for a while until it was time to move further. So that being said, I asked you to join me in a courtship. We got to enjoy a romantic dinner on the beach. We finally got to hold hands anytime we wanted to. Then a few years flew by and we announced that we are engaged to be married. What an exciting time. Now here we are. The time we have waited for our entire life has finally come. We are getting married. Abigail, I wouldn't want to spend my life with anyone else but you. God has truly blessed me. I don't deserve, can't wait to see what God has planned for us. Love, your soon-to-be husband. P.S. I'm ready to say I do. Let's gather around and pray over you all. Our Father, we come before your presence right now, thanking you, God, for what a good day this is. Lord, we thank you so much for Brother Bailey and Miss Abigail, their testimonies, for their families, God, what they stand for. And God, we're praying right now that you'd lay your hand upon our brother. I pray you'd settle his nerves. God, thank you for what this time represents and what it's about. Your hand be upon it is what we're begging. So God, this afternoon, I pray that the smile and kiss of God's approval might be on this wedding. And Father, I pray that you'd bless what goes on today. Bless the service. Let it go well. God, I pray if there be somebody out in this service that doesn't know Jesus, I pray they'd see Jesus in this service, in these young people, they'd come to know Christ. God, I pray that you might move around this place now. Bless what goes on. We'll thank you for it. In Jesus' name we pray and ask you. Amen. Lord, I thank you for this day, Lord. I thank you for Bailey and Abigail, God. I just pray, God, as they make a commitment to you and to each other, Lord, that you just bless their marriage. God, I just pray that you just be with them on this special day, God. I just pray that you just bless their home and all that you have done, Lord. We're just so thankful for all your many blessings, Lord. We thank you for 
the commitment that they have made to the church, Lord. I thank you for their families, Lord. Lord, I just thank you for Brother uh, Randy and Miss Cammy and Amber and Adam. God, I just pray to bless these homes, bless these families, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. And in so doing, have given and placed our vows to each other and had declared the same by the giving and receiving of a ring. I pronounce them man and wife in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Bailey, kiss your bride. I would like to now introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Bailey White. so good to us and uh, I just want to thank each and every one of you for coming out and experiencing what uh, we, we've got and may we never heal. They all have said to keep God first. He'll lead you guys in the direction. I love you both and uh, it's just been a wonderful, a great experience. I thought you'd drag me down the aisle but I made it down there so you got to drag me. And, uh, it,
here, boys. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>